What's up guys, this is Junior here from CR42 Hunting. If you guys know, if you've been following the channel for some time, we've been bringing you guys these homemade body armor videos that we've been doing. We have successfully been able to stop a nine millimeter. We've also stopped a 40, a 40 cal, but we've yet to be able to stop a rifle round for $20. So we're still trying. Today's video, we start off with our cookie sheets as usual. Uh, next, we start putting in our ready creed, our concrete. Uh, next, I went out and I bought some fiberglass mat to try to hold the concrete together. Uh, the fiberglass mat was about eight bucks. So we cut a couple of pieces to fit inside of the cookie sheets. Uh, we put them inside the cookie sheets on top of the first layer of concrete. And then after, we put another layer of concrete on and, and that's it. So we'll see how this works. Uh, I got confidence that the concrete and the fiberglass mat will work good together and it'll probably hold that concrete together when we take a, a few shots at it. But anyway, we'll let this sit for a few days and uh, we'll catch you guys on the range. So we're back. We got both pieces assembled. We got the fiber pieces in this concrete. So Zach and I are gonna put this together. Remember our ultimate goal is to see if we can create uh, some rifle rated body armor for under, under 20 bucks. Uh, right now we got about $15 in this. We got some, um, obviously the ready creek. And then we got the fiberglass pieces in and these cookie sheets were about a dollar. So Zach and I are gonna put these together and uh, take a shot with the nine and see what happens. All right, we'll be shooting this 125 grain, just some target load that we got sitting around. So we'll give it a shot and see what happens. Let's see what we got, man. So, here was our entry. And as you can see, it held up. So, nothing came out of the back. So, we'll set this back up and we'll take a shot with the AR 15. All right, guys. So, so far, our $15 body armor held up. Uh, we're going to give it a shot. With our rifle now, we got an AR-15. We'll be shooting this full metal jacket and this is 55 grain. So, borrow my buddy Jake's uh, AR-15 here. So let's give it a shot and see what happens. Well, you can see so far, uh, we're 0 for 3, right, Zach, on uh, our body armor and our, our rifle. So here's our entry. And oh, wow, 
Wow, look at that. Yep, blew the back right out of it. Well, we saw the 55 grain FMJ blow right through that. So why not? We'll use a 62 grain green tip, which got a, it's a steel tip projectile. Should blow right through it. That little steel tip should make a hole. A little different though, let's see. Let's see. All right, so Jake took a shot with the green tip and you can see our entry here and how it blew through the back, just like our 55 grain full metal jacket did. So we want to take a shot with that 308. So we're going to set this up. I'll come back and grab the 308 and we'll take a shot. Right, and we'll be running this 175 grain full metal jacket with the 308. Kind of damage we did, Zach. All right, so we caught it right here, the 308, and holy crap, got a much bigger hole. I don't have the other two, but see how it blew that out. See those fibers in there from the fiberglass. You know what I think? I think we should cut this open. You got your knife on you? Yeah, I do. And my hands are sticky, man. Let's see what we got. All right. Grab the bottom. Got it. Oh. You can fold that open. Let's see what we got. That's not too bad on the inside. I mean, the integrity on the inside is a lot better than I thought it would be on the entry side. Uh, I figured all this would be pretty shattered, but. It didn't really shatter all the concrete like it's done no. previously without the uh, the fiber fibers. Yeah. yeah, the fibers. You can see how the fibers held this together. Uh, you know, like I said, it, it went through obviously, but it, it did hold it together pretty good. So we have to come up with a couple of other ideas, and eventually we'll get something that's rifle rated. You know, that's our goal is we're trying to make something that's rifle rated under twenty dollars. Uh, we'll keep giving the shot. We appreciate you guys checking out the video. Make sure you uh, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button and uh, hit that notification bell so you guys know we got new videos coming out. And uh, we'll catch you guys next time.